hello everyone today i am going to discuss this nice problem on analysis and in this problem you can see you have to find all possible functions f from r to r satisfying the inequality f of x y plus f of x z is greater than or equal to 2 by 3 plus 3 by 2 f of x into f of y z for all values of x y z belongs to r okay so let's get started let p x y z be the assertion f of x y plus f of x z is greater than equal to 2 by 3 plus 3 by 2 f of x into f of y z for all values of x y z belongs to capital R okay then then P 0 0 0 imply what put x y x equals to y equals to z equals to 0 okay the star okay what we can write this takes the form f of 0 plus f of 0 is greater than equal to 2 by 3 plus 3 by 2 now f of x become 0 f of y z also become 0 so we can write f of 0 square okay now if we multiply by 2 by 3 in this inequality then what we can write uh, f 0 is square uh, and this becomes 2 f 0 and if we multiply by 2 by 3 this becomes uh, 4 by 3 f 0 okay uh, plus 4 by 9 is less or equals to 0 and this is very beautiful scene you can write it as a perfect square of f 0 minus 2 by 3 so this perfect square is less or equals to 0 but uh, we know that uh, the perfect square can never be less than 0 so the only possibility is what f of 0 is 2 by 3 f of 0 is 2 by 3 okay again p 1 1 1 implies p 1 1 1 means what put x equals to y equals to z equals to 1 in a star so we can write 2 times f of 1 is greater than equal to 2 by 3 plus 3 by 2 into f of 1 square okay so uh, similarly uh, similar uh, reason we can write uh, f 1 whole square f1 whole square minus 4 by 3 f1 plus 4 by 9 less or equals to 0 therefore we can write f1 minus 2 by 3 whole square less or equals to 0 so we get but more information from here f1 is also equals to 2 by 3 okay I'll move to the next page now now p x 0 0 implies what p x 0 0 means what put x e equals to x and y and z both are 0 uh, in inequality star okay so what we can write uh, what we can write from here p x 0 0 becomes what f 0 is square sorry uh, this becomes what uh, x uh, replace x by x and y and z both are 0 therefore star implies star implies f of 0 plus f of 0 is greater than equal to 2 by 3 plus 3 by 2 f of x times f of 0 but f of 0 is what f of 0 is 2 by 3 so this 3 by 2 and 2 by 3 cancel out so we can write 2 times f of 0 and f of 0 is clearly 2 by 3 is greater than equal to 2 by 3 plus f of x okay so from here we can write f of x f of x is less or equals to 2 by 3 and this result holds true for all values of x belongs to sorry x belongs to capital R because here uh, the domain is capital R okay this is our first result and again p x 
one one implies put uh, y equals to z equals to one in the inequality star so we can write uh, f of x plus f of x f of x plus f of x greater than equal to 2 by 3 2 by 3 plus 3 by 2 uh, 2 by 3 plus 3 by 2 f of x into into f of 1 but f of 1 is what f of 1 is 2 by 3 so we can cancel f of 1 and 3 by 2 f of 1 is 2 by 3 so from here what we can write 2 times f of x is greater than equal to 2 by 3 plus f of x this will imply f of x is greater than equal to 2 by 3 and this also holds true for all values of x belongs to r now look at these two condition uh, uh, condition number one and condition number two so from one and two from one and two what we can write we can write f of x is 2 by 3 for all values of x belongs to r and which clearly satisfy the given inequality hence proved thanks for watching